Now, originally you were scheduled to fight at UFC 173, mm-hmm. but you were facing Takeo Mizugaki. Then things got switched up, and they give you a call and say, hey, we want you to fight Henan Burrell for the belt. Tell me what that's like. It was exciting. I mean, I had a bunch of voicemails on my phone and text messages from my manager to, to give him a call. And instantly I knew that it was like probably my opponent changed. You know, it was, it, was, it was urgent that I needed to call him. I was kind of disappointed. I get home and he tells me uh, I changed my opponent, you know, and but it's for the title of the world. And uh, it just gave me goosebumps, you know. I couldn't help but yell in excitement. And uh, thank God I was at home because I didn't, <laughs> wouldn't scare anybody, you know. Just uh, surreal, dreams coming true. How do you feel that you match up with Burrell? I think I'm the one to beat him. I'm the one to end that streak. Um, just the way I fight, I feel like, is, is, is the key to beat him. Did it help having Uriah Faber prepare for Burrell twice? Absolutely. I think the, the first fight camp he had was the one that helped me out the most for this. It's going to help me out the most for this because I had to beat him and Burrell for 10 weeks. You know, I was Uriah's main spar- sparring partner, so I had to imitate what he does, the things he, the things he likes to do, and things... That how we think he can get beat, and so by me acting like Hannon Burrell for that that camp is going to help me pick him apart, I believe. The second camp wasn't as as helpful because it was such a short notice fight. It was quick, so I didn't get to get the game plan in as much. But the first one helped out a lot. Not only do you have a life changing title fight, but you also have a wedding a few weeks <laughs> after that. Uh, two giant life changing events in one month. Yeah, I actually <laughs> plan on wearing my belt as I get married. It's going to be <laughs> awesome. Yeah, uh, yeah, in June. Um, Tying the knot, it's exciting. How important is it for you to have not only a fiance who supports you, but also a family who really understands what you're doing and understands what you need? Yeah, it's, I mean, it's huge. I mean, that's what helped me get through all my wrestling career and get me into school and push me as far as I did that way. And then now in my career, I mean, they all of them understand what I have to go through and uh, guide me in the directions I need to be helped in and uh, are very understanding, which has helped out because they've been around for so long.